Hey, what's going on guys? It's Corey Vanderpool at Corey Photo on Twitter and Instagram. Today I want to show you a quick fix with Liquify regarding this sleeve. Now, uh, sometimes, you know, clothing just doesn't fit right. Um, it's just a little tiny fix that could have been happened on set, but instead uh, it just didn't get down and now we have to fix it in post. So how do you fix garment issues like this? Well, really what we want is we want the garment to hug her like this and maybe not even be there around the edge like this. So I feel like we want to push it towards her arm and kind of get rid of this gap. Am I right? We want to just take this and have that kind of hugging her arm. So I'm going to show you how I do that with Liquify. So first thing you want to do is shut off all your layers. Start with a new layer so you can mess around with masking and then we're going right into Liquify. So one, there's one thing you can do in Liquify that prevents you um, from touching anything is this. Now I don't use this that often because I like doing kind of everything by hand. But if you do use this, it's called the freeze mask tool. Now you can go in with the Liquify brush and I'm not affecting anything at all. I mean, and that's a pretty quick fix. I mean, you could massage it a little better, but it does look a little squished here. So I'm gonna show you what I want, I do. I'm not gonna deal or mess with any of this freezing, um, but I am gonna inch this slowly closer and closer because I don't like how that got squished through the freeze. And now we're gonna paint back what was originally there by creating a new mask making sure the background is white. So you come over here to your artboards and you make sure that you're painting on black with a, a brush of 100%. And now you just paint the arm back in. So it looks like I went a little too far on that. And now because I like going in and messing around and doing it by hand, I'm just gonna go back. I realized I pushed it in just a little too much. And I still need to go more. Back into liquify and just inch it. There you go, that's pretty good already. So now let me fix this up and see how we can get this to look uh, perfect. So we want the white now to kind of paint this in, give it the most that we can give. And now just paint the arm back as much as you can, get the original arm. And now switch your artboard using the mask and paint it in. I mean, that's already considerably better and it looks more realistic than the squished one. And then you gotta paint this all the way in on this outside because you're really just looking for a line that you can draw against because that's the lines that save you. It's hard to recreate new material, but if you have a line like at the edge of an arm, that's what helps you. All right, so this already looks way better feel like we can just do it slightly better. So I'm gonna go back in one more time and really inch it in. And we're talking, zoom in here, hug it in just even a little bit more, tiny details, much better. It doesn't need to hug too much because you saw naturally in the garment, whoops, flip X, flip it. You saw naturally that the garment had a little bit of a wave to it and it just wasn't sitting just perfect. Sometimes that imperfection is great. There's an old saying that perfection is ugly. So a little bit of imperfection is perfect. I mean, this already looks way better. And one thing you can do is just take a curves tool, bring it down a little bit and then just kind of fill this shadow in. Again, I use a lot of contrast, so I wouldn't really need to use this. 
and just paint this in to, to make the shadow a little bit more natural because it was so far away from the skin. So now when you do this, uh, it looks way better and uh, it looks more believable. So there you have it. That's the big difference. Big swoop like this. Uh, a little bit of a wardrobe malfunction when you add the two layers. It looks much better. Actually, what I think I went a bit far with this. One of my favorite things to do in Photoshop is flick layers on and off to see how close you were to the original. And this just looks way better. All right, guys, quick tip how to fix garments. Stay tuned for more. My name's Corey Vanderpool at Corey Photo on Twitter and Instagram. Happy shooting.